What the hell? What are you doing? It was in my face. So I made it not in my face. I made it go up. No, you didn't. I did. See, it's not in my face anymore. Can you explain that, huh? Hmm? It's called wind. What's that? So, I don't know if that's going to focus very well. But, um, yeah. It's, uh, it, Are you playing with dolls? It, I am. It's sort of, so, it's a, it's a. Everyone knows that I'm super into 40K, which is a strategic game with miniatures. Dolls. Been for like a long time. <laughs> it's been like 40 years. So, but they made their first action figure through Bandai. And um, it's kind of cool. What? Those are his hands. Extra hands. Extra hands. Because everybody should have a pair of extra hands. But it's kind of cool. I mean, you can kind of see it's kind of cool. But it's super poseable. So, like, his toes, I don't know if it's going to focus, his toes can pose. Uh huh. Which is kind of weird. And, like, all of the armor comes off. All of the armor. Like, these things and these elbow guards and these side hip panels and. All the armor comes off, and it's cool. It's super posable. It's just like you can't. It's not like action figure plays hold. Freaking cow moves. It's super posable, but it's just not. I don't know. It's not playable, and the gun is ridiculously oversized. Yeah, let's see. So look at it. The gun is like half as tall as him, or more than half as tall as he is. That's. <laughs> I, I get it. This is nonsense toys. So you're disappointed in your doll? I, I'm a little disappointed because this is the first time I've ever did this. They didn't make it. They outsourced it to Bandai. And it was a big deal. I ordered this in November. It just came. That's how long it's taken. And since then, they've switched contracts to McFarlane toys. So the next ones are going to be rock awesome. Because McFarlane guy made Spawn. Okay. He's pretty cool. And he makes great action figures. And I, I'm not even into action figures, but this one's... I mean, it's kind of cool. The gun just makes me annoyed. The gun's annoying. The annoying gun. I'm, just, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry the gun is annoying. <sighs> anyway. So this has just been a whole day of playing with toys. Because I've been playing with my toys, too. I play, I play open this for 20 minutes. <laughs> all day. You think I've been sitting in... Well, the dude has been playing on the Xbox dude. all day. Playing with his toys. And I have been out here uh, gardening for the first half of the day. So I'll show you that. So out here, I planted my cucumbers and they're gonna grow up on this trellis, right? That, and then over here, I planted our zucchinis and our yellow squash. And these, um, I was reading the reason why uh, my zucchinis and yellow squash get powdery mildew all the time is it's wet here in the northwest and so I should try to get them up off the ground and I should also take a few leaves away to get better airflow around the plant. So hopefully those doodads that I created out of some old um, crates, not crates, what are those called? Pallets. Um, We'll do the trick and we'll get some actual zucchinis that aren't rotten because it's so wet here. Also, um, daddy -O has been using the shed as his office and we never did finish the insulation on the roof part. So I have gotten out my circular saw. There's my other toy that I've been playing with today. And uh, we've been cutting up insulation and then the dude just got in here. Don't die, dude. I'm just trying to put these panels up. Dude, are you finally gonna help me now that you're done playing Xbox? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. You can head up there if you want to. I'll hold the ladder. Yeah. Anyway, I'm trying to put those panels in on the roof because it looks like uh, Daddy O is gonna be using this as his office space. Um, for a while. 
Uh, I, we don't know because of this pandemic thing. So I'm just trying to make him a little more comfortable out here if he's going to have to do this all summer and maybe into the winter next this next year. So um, hoping that these panels will do the trick and keep the temperature more even with our little heater and air conditioner that we have out here. And he doesn't either freeze or burn to death. So. Anyway, yes, so dude. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna hand you some panels. We're gonna finish those last two pieces up there. Okay, you like it up there? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Every weekend we'll be doing this until it's fixed up nice. I know, that's why I want to put a railing there so you don't fall out of the loft. Well, no, I, I just, it's not scary like, like you have in the NV that tall. Uh -huh. It's just scary when you come down. Yes. I was just going to show you guys my awesome beans. So, these are my awesome beans. That's the last of the garden because nothing else is coming up yet. Um, so, dude, daddy -o. what are you doing now? Oh, paint. Because I don't have enough paint yet. No, you know, you'll never have enough did paint. Did you tell them, did she tell you that it was the dude's birthday this past week? Oh, I did not. I forgot. So, you guys see this. So, so this is his birthday cake. This was made by his sister. And it's a Catan birthday cake. So Catan is a board game. For those of you that don't know, Catan is a board game that is very, very popular and very famous. And it's been around everywhere for years. So she made this out of cupcakes, as you can see here, and put the little pieces are all fondant. And it's just awesome. And those of you that know Catan, this is a great cake. So then he had his birthday with all of his presents. And so here is a birthday of him with his stack of stuff and you can see there's ridiculous amounts of stuff all those stuff all that stuff on the top is all Pokemon boxes <laughs> yes and then there's like uh, I don't know, there's all sorts of stuff in that there's he got everything I think he asked for a book and some cool books from his grandparents and um, all sorts of stuff as you can see so but anyway so that was his birthday um, but he's 13 right? yeah he's an actual teenager now actually teen though and he's making a of crazy noises he's waiting for you huh yeah here okay. doesn't look like he's waiting are you up there dude good grief good luck with that action so anyway yeah weird week yeah again we're just working mom's working like a mad person bug um, uh, 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 well, this is all my paint stuff, right? Because I'm a giant nerd or geek, whatever you want to call them, creating. Um, so yeah, you guys have seen the garage before. You know how crazy it is here. Um, but that's where I'm building my miniatures for games. Anyway, um, so yeah, that's been kind of the busy part of what we've been doing nothing really exciting um nathan's birthday and then morgan and he finished school this year which are this week which was awesome uh looks like um even with all of her honors classes and advanced classes uh and dual credits dual credit classes um she just got her grades for the end of the year and she's got straight a's so that's pretty awesome that she got uh A's in all of her her four. She's got four advanced classes and some other classes. So anyway, blah 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 blah. But pretty awesome in general. Um, next year um, is her sophomore year, and sophomore um, she'll be uh, doing high school, and then that'll be it. Her junior and senior year she's going to take it college um, because she's on the advanced track. So she'll be doing college her junior and senior year at a local university here and so when she graduates high school she'll also graduate with her associates at the same year same time and then she'll go to a four-year college so pretty sweet and she's right on track straight A's so awesome mom 
wants to have a fire. So we would typically have a fire over there. But because the tent's there, and that's the hazmat unit, if you will, we cannot have the fire there. So we're gonna have the fire here. Morgan, fire pit maker. Hit. You're making it right now. Look at yourself. Yeah, that's a start. We obviously did not clean the last fire out. Oh, my fire stopped. Oh, my fire stopped. You should go finish the lawn. Too much leaves. Grass. Yeah. Oxygen deprived. Dude, not helpful. Fire. Fire. Make fire. Dude. What, what are you doing? I'm making Is that what this is? Yeah. Okay. You're a little dangerous there. I feel dangerous and I'm way up here. It's kind of scary down there, man. That's fine. Oh my god. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's not an axe in your hand. Just keep... Oh, jeez. Well, soon we'll have fire right there. Alright, the dude's lighting it. Maybe. Are you lighting it, dude? Yeah. I don't feel like... What, did you light it? Yeah, I don't even see it. Sorry. Can't see from here. It's pretty far. Fire! I see fire. We now know paper burns. It's great. We have no idea if we have a long-term fire yet, though. Hello, Mom. <laughs> oh, that's not bad. It's crackling. It's good. Good sign. Good sign. Are you afraid of fire over there? Why do you keep moving away? Ash! I, I don't like ash! Just have to control it. Make it stop being weird. What? Control the, the, the smoke. Sure. I played a prank on Nathan when he was like five years old and he bought the soil and he could control the fire with his hand and he still believes it. And it works! I get the I get the smoke away from me. It works. It doesn't. Strength turns into a power. Power. That's good fire right there. Yep. Well done. Well. What the hell? What are you doing? It was in my face. So I made it not in my face. I made it go up. No, you didn't. That's it. See, it's not in my face anymore. Can you explain that, huh? Hmm? It's called wind. It's called magic. It's not coming out of the you broke. You broke your brother. I told him that when he was five, I didn't expect him to believe it until he turned 13. He thinks he's a mutant. Yeah, well, At least you didn't tell him he could, like, draw metal to him. Oh, I actually did. Oh. <laughs> Fire. 